Hey, what's up? This is Jared with The Daily App Show. So, Notemaster is going to revolutionize the way that you take notes on your iPhone or your iPod Touch, especially if you email those notes often or if you have a Google Docs account. Just really quickly, a Google Docs account allows you to kind of use basic Word, Microsoft Word-like functionality um, in an online user interface and share all of that stuff with other people. So it's kind of like documents, creating documents and being able to share those socially with other people. Um, so there, there's my Google Docs plug. Um, and it works with this application. So right from the get-go, you're in your categories. So we can go and create categories um, and even lock those categories by password. That's a great idea. I love that. So you can lock these things by password. Just simply put in um, a title, turn on password, type in your password, and confirm and hit done. So now we've got a locked section right here. If we want to enter that section, we have to put in the password. Hit OK. Once we enter that section, whether it be the locked or the unlocked categories, does not matter, your screen's going to look like this. So you can go and add a new note. Now what's awesome about this and definitely unique about this application is that notes are no longer just text. They are text, images, whatever you can capture with the iPhone you can put into a note in this application. So let's uh, type in new note. I'll call it new note one. Hit done. Notice that it's locked because it's or that's the locked category that it's in. You can simply view information about that right here and add it to other categories if I would like or change the name. Now you can see down here on the bottom I have different options. I can write, so I can add text. That's good. I can add images from my photo library. So let's add the uh, Daily App Show logo. So now we've got the Daily App Show. You see we've got a little X box right there so we could hit that box if we'd like to delete that, that item out of the note. And then we can also take a picture using our camera uh, and take a picture right into a note as well. We can change the font and size of our notes and as you can see it gives you uh, a, a test right up here so you can see exactly uh, what it's going to look like. You can see the text is updated right there. So we can pretty much do anything in this application as far as creating notes and then once we're done we can email those notes out from within the app or we can post them to our Google Docs account, which is great because then you have an off-site backup as well. Um, so let me show you how that works. Um, right from within the app, I can hit Mail here, and if I've configured uh, my mail within the application, it will go ahead and let me send that. If I have not, then it's going to go ahead and send out my uh, email through the regular email application. So let's get out of this and go back into NoteMaster. Down here you will see the settings button, which is where you would set up your, uh, your default start screen, your default font, you'd configure your email information, and then you, you, you set up the Google Docs syncing right here as well. So you'd enter your login password, you can create a sync folder so that your notes from NoteMaster on your iPhone or your iPod Touch will go specifically to a folder uh, on your Google Docs. If you use Google Docs, then you know how awesome this function is. We can also reset the sync system right there. So right here will allow us to sync everything out, kind of a force sync, but since we don't have anything set up right now, we have to, uh, it gives us a warning to go ahead and set that up first. So what's awesome about this app is yes it takes notes, yes it lets you put in some images and some different stuff, change the fonts uh, and all that good stuff within the app, but it lets you send out emails with the images and everything intact within the application. So sending out those notes just like you see them after you type them. And then also the Google Docs syncing. And then to put icing on top of all of that, you have the ability to password protect some of your note sections uh, by category, which is great. Having multiple categories, this app just has a lot of functionality for such a small price. So I recommend that you check out NoteMaster today. It's going to revolutionize the way that you take notes on the iPhone. 
Take care and we'll see you next time on The Daily App Show.